Okay, so we're here in St. George and we're gonna demo this horse rooster. He's eight years old. This horse is 15-1 ish. I love the way he's put together. I've seen videos of him. He sent me videos before I came down here, but I've never seen the horse or or been on him. But I'm gonna walk around him. This horse is a great size for a head horse. He seems super good if you want to just walk around him and I don't see any marks on him. Bryce Walker just kind of come all the way around him. He's put together like a champ, I think. Good confirmation, good size to ride. Like this horse on the videos, he looks like he's so freaking catty and athletic that I expect great things. Eight years old, perfect, perfect age to, to kind of get and take and make your own and be able to ride him for 10 years. Might be me, you never know. So I'll lead him, just walk away and I'll come back. Kind of nice to just be able to watch him travel away from you and back to you, hopefully. It's not right behind you where you can see him moving a little bit. Seems real easy to be around, super gentle. Let's throw a saddle on him and see, see how it goes. I'm gonna step on him, that horse looks pretty dang good. He ran two steers, the first one he let out way too far for as hard as they run. Horse scored flat, left flat. Got that steer legal as soon as his head rope went on, that horse looked pretty good. So, let's try him.
the toughest conditions you'll put a horse under, in my opinion. Little freaking black natives that feel like they're crossed between a Corini bull and a deer. They just run like a summer gun, and we've scored a couple, but just back to back to back, and this horse is running so freaking hard every time. I've messed up on a couple, but this horse has stayed flat in the box. He's leaving flat. Kind of wants to turn his head in the box and just mess around a little bit, but not one time has his front end ever came off the ground or he tried to tried to rebel. He's wanting to like prance a little bit and be a little bit jiggy, but for as tough as conditions as we are, man, this horse is doing amazing. I've did a bad job of like this horse runs, and so I kind of got to going going fast and and messed up a couple and and actually pulled a couple like a little bit too fast through the corner they're pretty fresh instead of just letting him work and me slow down so the last two i tried to just go up there and rope him and and sit down and just let him throttle down through the corner and give give a little bit better slower more controlled handles and felt like it was it was way better horse feels feels heavier looking at him from right here than he did just looking at him standing by him without the saddle on big thick shoulders and pretty thick neck put together pretty good I really feel like this horse, if you're willing to put up with just a tiny bit of a nervousness, this horse is gonna take your game and elevate it. I saw videos of this horse and they sent me two different videos and I was excited to come here and ride this horse and under the, the, the conditions that we just roped under, this horse was everything I hoped, hoped he would be. I mean, he was just easy to score, tons of run, never tried to duck. Just a, just a great horse that was, like I said, a few little quirks, but was really enjoyable to head at a high level on.